Hello my yarny friends and uh, sewing buddies and yes sewing sisters as it may be. Yes here is here is uh, Lucky Pants up here uh, deciding to um, be the center of attention. Right Mr. Man? Um, he is just a rotten boy. I am trying to untangle some major yarny goodness and he wants all the attention. He is driving me insane -oh. Um because every time I get a skein loose from the pile of well you know what we call it girls guys the yarn barf Yes, <laughs> here it is. Every time I get a skein loose from this and put it to the side, he wants to jump up in my lap or, oh, jump up on the bed like he just did on top of all of this yarn. Goodness, there he goes. Did you find you a spot, little man? I've also folded my laundry and I've gotten that part done. Yeah, we were talking about how I wanted to get into some yarny goodness and I am just in love with the squishy mess that's getting ready to be totally discombobulated out of this conglomeration of yes, what you see is what you get. I bought like all of this out of the um, yarn <laughs> out of the yarn bin at my local um, bargain hunt. I was in there hunting for yarn. I didn't look in the right place. I was like it's got to be here somewhere. I've heard there's yarn at these places and uh, a lot of this was bought out from Target. Yes, some Targets have closed in my uh, area, but I was walking around and I saw um, a couple pieces of this gray stuff. Um, let me see if I can get a big funky chunk of it. Yes, this, this, this kind right here. I found this one and was like, mm, okay. Uh, there's got to be yarn here in this store. If I found a piece of yarn, here's the other parts to it all down inside this lovey right here. There has to be yarn somewhere in the store. So after perusing around and finding all kinds of yummy goodness that I got, whether I needed it or not. Um, I asked someone and they were like, oh, I, we have it. Let me find out where it is. So they directed me to this bin at the middle of the front of the store and I was like, okay, what do we do with this? So, yes, I was thinking, okay, how much is this yarn? And how much do they want for it? What's it worth? <laughs> Another question. What is the worth of this? So I was checking it all out and I'm like, this is priced at two something, 225 a skein. Half of them didn't have the skein um, wrap on it. It was just like in the bottom of the bin or all wrapped up in this mess. Uh, so I took and <laughs> was like, shall we give them an offer? It's called a bargain hunt. So I was hunting for a bargain. So I gave them a price. I said, I'll give you $2 for this mess here. But I'm not paying $2 for one skein. So he called his manager over, um, well, on, on his little phone thingy. He called her up and she goes, 
50 cents a skein and yes we'll take two dollars for that uh, big pile of yarn there so what they don't know is that we do know how to do the magic knot <sighs> yes so we can actually use this good stuff to make all kinds of um, it could be a stash buster but who knows when I get all this taken apart who knows how much yarny goodness I'm going to be uncovering um, to add to my uh, stash over here so that yes we will have some good stuff happening mm. back here we are so that uh, were semi neat um, and I've already pulled all of the blue out of this um, mess in my lap all the blue oh here's another one yeah so there's about one two three four there's five of these plus some more that's down inside here so um a lot of yawning goodness. It's clean. It's just in a big mess. I don't know what happened um, when no one was looking, but this is what it looks like. And chances are it came into the bargain hunt store like this and they were thinking, we'll never sell this. Well, surprise, this girl loves her yarning goodness. And I came on the scene yesterday and walked away with 90 some dollars worth of uh, line brand and there's another brand yarn yeah it's all line brand maybe uh, say for a couple of a uh, couple of other things that were going on in there for I got all of this for 10 bucks plus all that's on the bed that's not a mess so exciting um, wonderful day a great yarn haul uh, this is my sewing stuff over here yeah got a whole bunch going on in this craft room but I'm signing out this is Dora with Mimi makes with hypogamma globulinemia so this is what keeps me busy keeps my mind off of crazy health issues because I can sit in my little my um, yarnscape and craft and uh, sew or do other things when I'm having good days. So this is a good day. Laundry is folded and it's time to play with yarn. Y'all have a great day and enjoy your yarny goodness.